Welcome to the Cocktail Chronicles. We're on the sexiest city in the planet, Miami, Florida. Today, we're in Brickell. We're gonna take you to all the hot spots right around town. So let's get ready to go. Hi, my name is David Ortiz, AKA Little Poppy in the cocktail community. I have 35 years of experience in the hospitality industry. Since I'm 18 years old, I've been behind the stick. I've been a busboy, bar back, waiter, manager, you name it, I've done it. For the last 10 years, I've been on the distribution side, and I've had the pleasure of making some great friends and acquaintances. Today, I decided to go out and meet some of them in the coolest places to taste their latest creations and to guide you around our beautiful city. One night, four places, here at Cocktail Chronicles. Here we are at the East Hotel, Brickell City Center. We're gonna go upstairs to Sugar to meet my dear friend, Cool. So we're here with my good friend, Koo. We go way back, as a matter of fact. Way back. Nice to have you. Pleasure. Thank, Thank you, you for, for being having here. us. Tell me a little bit about the culture and uh, the, the program that you have going up here at uh, Sugar. For me, it is about sort of bringing the, the traditions of Asia and how beautiful that culture is. The modern world of, of Miami, the modern world of, of Brickell. So it reflects on the, on the menu. 100%. I'm looking at that lychee blossom and I'm thinking, yeah, we got Done. we got to try that. Done. So with the lychee blossom, it is one of our most popular cocktails. That's great. Um, I think it balances perfectly what sugar and what East Hotels is all about, right? right so it right. comes together in this amazing narrative all through a beverage. So of course, with that, we have our sake, we have our lychee in that, right. and the Russian standard vodka. That whole vodka. East, that whole Absolutely. East. I'm excited. But all these cocktails, that's what it's about, right? right? It's about bringing that Asian fusion that to it. That experience. Absolutely. That experience. Well, let's taste it, see how it goes. Oh my God, the balance. Right? That's, That's what it's delicious. about. delicious. I it's got a little bit on my flavor saver. We're gonna keep <laughs> it going. You guys are carrying over the view, the reflection of the cocktails and the food and the combination, the guest experience, I can see it. And let me tell you, you knocked it out of the park. Thank you very you know, much. This is beautiful. Well, thank thank you. you very much for having us. Absolutely. Thanks thank for being you. Here. Anytime, really. Anytime, you are always welcome. Thank you. I will really. be back. And with that being said, drink well and keep it sexy. Aloha. We just left Sugar with my dear friend, Koo. What a spot, man. Great happy hour location, great view. But it's getting a little later. We're gonna go to a restaurant that has a great cocktail program, Tacoology, right here in Brickell. I'm here with my dear friend, Diego. How are you, Diego? Good, man, thank you. Awesome. Thank you for awesome. coming. Thank you for uh, having us, for hosting us this evening at Cocktail Chronicles. We're here to talk about your cocktail program, and I know that you have an authentic cocktail on the menu that really resonates with the restaurant and with the vibe. Tell me a little bit about it. One of the most like Mexican cocktails yeah, we have in here yeah. is the chamoyada, which is like a traditional ice cream they usually eat in the streets, which right. is mango with chamoy. Nice. Chamoy is like a spicy syrup. And it's I really... see it's made with Maestro Dobel, yeah, my yeah. favorite, <laughs> my favorite. And also I see you have a coconut margarita. Yeah, it's oh, very it's refreshing. Oh, that's, that's For ladies, it's amazing. The coconut margarita is made with 1800 coconut. 1800 coconut, yeah. another one of my favorites. <laughs> yeah, we're trying to put like all our cocktails in the way of uh, tequila and mezcal. Okay. Cool. Rafa is gonna make the coconut margarita and the chamoyada as well. Oh, I'm excited, Rafa. you see this great presentation thank that, you that looks gorgeous what do you what's on the rim of it tajin the tajin yes it's spicy oh, sauce i love tajin i usually don't drink to a straw but i want to get the full experience of it boom that's delicious what's this here man that's our beautiful garnish it's it a nice. candy it's a mexican candy made with um, chamoy and uh, tamarind let me dig into that it's making me hungry all right, I think that's a perfectly balanced. It's not overly hot. It's got a nice little spice to it. Yeah. That balances out the sweetness of the mango. Hey, hey that's a perfect match in Charlie Cacho. Beautifully balanced. Man. Yeah. Great job, bro. Thank you, man. Let's talk it. about the coconut margarita. And we're using the uh, 1800 18... coconut. Uh, pineapple juice. Yeah. Pineapple juice. We use, it's gonna we be use the... uh, coconut cream that's called Coco Lopez. Traditional. Yeah. The traditional uh, yeah. coconut cream. It's like cream. a piña colada. Absolutely. Very tequila. well known for piña colada. Like a colada. Mexican piña colada. That's what's up. Let me give this a good taste. 
I'm on the beach. Yeah. <laughs> I am on the beach. I'm definitely coming back for the chamuyaya and the coconut margarita. I'm probably gonna take these two with me right now. <laughs> This is your home, whenever you Thank want. Thank you, Thank you very much, my brother. Thank you guys for coming. Oh, I appreciate no. it. Oh, oh, all the time.